So according to time, we went each. Uh, about this is so dark. Mm. So, what is the the meaning of Mahasati Bhattana? Maha is a great. Uh, Sati, you already know, it is mindfulness or remembrance. Bhattana is according to commentary's explanation it is the same thing with the city another name of a city so the meaning of city is arising by separating by flying I'm going into. So, this is uh, the meaning of Bhattana, one meaning. Another meaning is, may it translate, <coughs> appearing, appearing. So, so, Sati, Maybe a bit different from English uh, translation. So, Sadi is only one. But uh, here, uh, you may read Chadara Sati Prana, four Sati Prana. So, saying four, it is only one, but based on its object. Object has a four types. Because of this, based on object, uh, city become four. So, how do we fall? City, taking a rupa as an object, it is one. Number two, city, taking a vedana as an object. Number three, city, Taking chaita as an object. Number four, sati taking in dharma as an object. All together, four. So before going to this sutta, uh, we may explain about vipassana, vipassana practice, because this sutta is related to vipassana directly also some samatha practice or concentration practice so what is a vipassana uh, i may say here uh, with the four numbers uh, number one the sanning in rupa number two Descending in Nama. Number three, descending in cause and effect. Number four, by seeing a rising and perishing, contemplate as a nature, impermanence, dukkha, suffering, and another non self. So, all together, four. It is the way to practice vipassana. So in this four, so number one rupa, number two nama, number three, although we say cause and effect. So cause and effect of what? Cause and effect of nama rupa. It is also nama rupa. Number four is rising and perishing. It is also nama rupa. Rising, rising and perishing of what? Arising and perishing of Nama Rupa. So, if we want to combine as a two, we can say only Nama Rupa. So, it is dividing this body into two. One is a Nama, one is a Rupa. So, 
dividing into two ways. So you may also heard five aggregates, five kanda. So if we divide this body into five, can be five aggregates. So ruba is a ruba, nama divide into four. So vedana, senya, sankara, vijnana. If we divide nama into four, so become five aggregates. When you practice vipassana, you can practice it as nama rupa way, as, a, as a two nama rupa. You can also practice as five, so five aggregate ways. So if you divide into 12, so 12 ayatana, you may know. So you can divide this body into 12. So if so, it is ayatana way. So in the same way, if you want to divide this body into 18, it is called 18 dadu. So in this way, how much you want to divide this body into two? If so, you can practice as a nama rupa. If, if you want to do into five, you can practice five aggregates. If you want to have more numbers, more details, if you want to go, you may go 12. So, if you want to do more details, you may do 18. So in this way, uh, which number you like, <laughs> you want to do? Or two, or five, twelve, or eighteen. So this is my second round of ways, number four, only four ways. You will divide your body into four. So those four will be the object of a setting under presence. So because of this, it is a four uh, great mindfulness. So how to divide in Mahasati Prana Soda? Uh, Ruba, Ruba is one. But uh, using as a kaya, kaya nupasana. So, rupa is just one. For the nama, the Buddha divide into three. Virana, Chaita, and Dhamma. So, the Buddha divide the nama into three in this sota. So, Virana, Chaita, and Dhamma. Uh, Vedana is a, a kind of mental factor which is important because everybody uh, everybody know their their feeling. It is obvious factor. So take out separately. So for the other mental factors, uh, the Buddha use just dhamma, dhamma. So dhamma can cover all all mental factors. So. Although can cover all mental factors, uh, something already taken out. For example, kaya. Kaya means the same as rupa. So, vedana and chaita. So, for the dhamma, so may have two ways. Uh, we take all factors which can cover with the word dhamma. Or we only take uh, some factors uh, which uh, haven't taken before. 
uh, so have a two ways. <clears throat> Uh, so Dhamma can cover all factors. As a word, as a word, it can cover all factors. But because of staying together, so for example, you can take the other factors except without the material. This is the one thing. Or you can also take all factors, including the value of the material. So, taking away the test of two ways. So, if we, we take an exact previous one, all that there are only senior and senior effects, right? When you buy it, Otherwise, the thing is that Rupa would not is it the same as that would not have that right. I can't have the distinction of the same as that. So, for that, for that, for me, send out the same card. So, another way of taking is that all that does, including Rupa would not take that. So about the the word Dhamma, uh, we can hear many times. So everybody say, I will learn Dhamma like that. The meaning of that Dhamma is Vinaya Soda Bhirama. Because Dhamma can cover all. But sometimes we say Dhamma Vinaya, Dhamma Vinaya, like that. So, if so, Vinaya is already, Vinaya is, uh, Vinaya will take in later. So, because of this, uh, for the Dhamma only left, uh, so down, be Dhamma. So, Dhamma can also mean Vinaya, but uh, Vinaya, We'll take later. We'll take later. And later. So because of this, uh, for the Dhamma, I uh, can only say, so Dhamma be Dhamma. Okay, in the same way, we can hear about the Dhamma in the six Aramana. So six Aramana, the last one is the Dhamma Aramana. So, in the same way, in the 12th Ayadana, the last one is the Dhamma Ayadana. In the same way, in 18 Dhamma, so the last one is the Dhamma Dhamma. So the meaning of Dhamma are all the same, but to pick up uh, the, the factors, to pick up the reality. realities are different uh, based on condition. Condition means based on what we have said or what we will say later. So, so Dharma in a different place will pick up uh, different different practice, different ultimate realities based on conditions. So, <clears throat> and this is uh, explaining about the Dhamma Nubhasana Sri Prana. Uh, so, we should stop here about the Dhamma. So, okay, so Mahasati Prana Sauta's teaching is dividing this body into four. Kaya, Kaya Rupa, the same. Kaya, Vena, Seya, Nam, Dharma. Okay.
those that all uh, minor elements. The lower is the Anjali. Number two, Samajana. Number three, Sajima. So, Anjali is uh, the name of Vidya, the name of that part. Why we call that part as Anjali? Anjali means that which can burn, can burn the armaments. The effort which can burn the armaments. So, for example, when you do breathing, when you try to practice breathing meditation, maybe you have an effort, uh, no chance of all the departments. You're always trying to know. So, it is a burning the departments. So, because of this, when you descend for formation of mindfulness or for mindfulness, you, know, you need to make that part. You make and uh, you burn the comments. So it is called unhappy. If you practice, you must be that unhappy. So whether you are sitting, standing, walking, or lying down, you need to have that thought. So the mind may go away in one way. You should not allow your mind to think here and there, except in meditation. So you always are trying to think your meditation. So although you don't need to try uh, too much, but I said you have to you have to have a blood jam to go back to your meditation. So, the next effect is the Samjana. Samjana is the name of strength. So, in a body, which object we should change? How do we change? So, you need to know. Even breathing from the amount of pain is where we need to pay attention. So we need to learn. So this kind of wisdom is called Samadhi Arno. You need to know what is the Kaya, what is the Mirina, what is the Jaya, uh, what is the Dhamma. You need to know. Next, next factor is a sati uh, having sati. It is the name of sati. Today you shall translate the mindfulness. So also remember. So you need to remember you are all dead. Maybe kaya, maybe virina, maybe tenya, maybe dhamma. So you need to remember. Without remembering those objects, you cannot practice. Because of this, whether you are sitting, standing, lying down, or walking, you need to remember your object. If you are writing Kaya, you should remember Kaya. If you are writing Vedana, Seda, Dhamma, you should remember Vedana, Seda, Dhamma. So, it is called. The next word to explain is we may unlock a greater longness and that group should stay by removing a beta and longness. Desmond's uh, anger locking in the inner world. In the world that means in, in, in your voice, in the Bible. In a body, a body is a fire machine. You are a fire machine and you are a So, by removing a major lower greed or judgment, lowness, lowness is anger. Many departments, these two are very important. So, normally, 
sacrificing our body, we may test the games, or we may be sad. Uh, I'm not sure. How do we turn now? How hard is that? How do we have? Like that. My kid actually will always be good. But I can talk to us. We can't again. So, the Lord has said not to be so. Not to have it. You wish to see your body uh, in the right way. Right way means the body is a body. We have the same thing here. They got the same thing. Drama is a drama. You should not have an attachment. You should not have being disquieted, anger. So, no matter who may have, but surprises in the night, should not have. Even we see body as a body, we may have a human, etc., etc., as a jama, we will not have a great amount of knowledge. Even we see it in any other way, as a me or mine, we may not have a great amount of knowledge. My son and daughter, they will be seen in this way, they uh, are known as somewhere around. So, because of this, by presenting body as a body, etc., they will just say, by removing the way they are known as in the world. In the world, that means in the higher case. Okay. Okay. So, I miss that. For only four minor premises, this was a complicated discussion. Ida me punya, Ida me punya, Ida Mama punya bakam. Saba satanam Rajemi Esame Esamang Bunya Bakam Laba 